Hey, how's it going? So today we're going to do a um, very brief introduction, um, and I'll show some features as well of Atticus. Atticus, this cute puppy over here. So um, if you're new to the channel, um, welcome. I'm, uh, I'm I I do you know low no content um, and a bit of self publishing of um, so far a couple of non fiction books. Um, so yeah, let's jump in. Atticus is the um, uh, software the next generation of software created by um, or co-created by Dave Chesson who is the um, Kindlepreneur um, if anyone is aware of a publisher rocket that's that's him um, he's the creator of that so Atticus let's just jump right in I signed up to join the waitlist <laughs> this was many months ago um, and I got a um, a beta version of the software and we're just going to run through some of the features. Um, it's being rolled out and more features are being added so I'm going to include um, links in the description so you don't have to worry about memorizing all the <laughs> the website URLs. I just want to show you the roadmap before we launch into the actual um, uh, app. Okay so there's a roadmap and this is what they've done so far. Okay you can check that out. Um, what they're working on at the moment, all right, and what they have planned next. So it is still a work in progress, and they are, you know, always updating and including new features. So this is the roadmap. Um, I guess I should cover support. So if you need any support, they've got a fantastic team over there. I've emailed a few times, and they've always got back to me very quick in under 24 hours, <laughs> polite and professional. And also, don't forget to check out tutorials. So if you if you have any issues, check out the tutorial section first. I just started with Word doc because that's what I use to, um, to write my manuscript in. And it brings you to a page like this, how to prepare your Word doc for upload. Incidentally, I, I, I don't think they've announced it. <laughs> if they have, it's been very quiet, but they've actually got a uh, YouTube um, channel. So if you want to go and check out their YouTube channel, you know, Atticus is what it's called. So let's dive right in. So um, if you got the program, or if you got the software, you can access it from the Chrome's app page, or you can go to the um, the website itself. So this is the web login, app atticus.io, sign in, and you can sign in there. I'm going to show you the app. So when I click on this, this is what comes up. Okay, and before this comes up, you have to log in. So I took a screenshot, and this is the app login page. It's pretty much the same as the web login page. So that's the app login page, and then it'll bring this up. And I tested it, uploading a new book, sorry, starting a new book from scratch, and where you type in, literally type in to um, start your book. So let's just go through that. So I just typed this in, in the body of the manuscripts, I've typed in a chapter title, I can add a chapter, so you can add a chapter, you can call it uh, random chapters, oh, if I can spell, <laughs> random chapter title, and then you can add a subheading, I'm going to do quotes, um, he who dares wins, I think that's SAS, I don't know, um, anyway, and then you can literally begin writing your, write your Ooh, manuscript. Okay, so there you go. Um, it, it, it's actually got a word counter as well. <laughs> Pretty cool. Um, the front matter, they suggest you just go directly using this to type in your front matter. So if you're importing from elsewhere, they suggest you leave that um, out. And then you can have the table of contents, which already includes these two um, chapter titles. The copyright page, and you can customize it according to whatever you feel like. Um, so feel feel free to do that. And the title page is where you put in your book title, your author name, publisher name, subtitle and such, okay? So I tried that out um, with the new book. I also tried the upload function where I drag and dropped a, <laughs> a, very, a very basic Word document, filled this in, author, uh, title, author and project name, and then go get an Atticus and this is what came up, sorry, test over here. It's not very creative. I called everything test. <laughs> Sue me. You know, it's just test. It's a test function. It's not creative. Um, just to show you that it can be done. And the table of contents, again, it pulls right in from the um, body, body matter. 
And once you're done, all you have to do, feel free to browse around, by the way, book cover, um, ISBNs, you can enter that, publish your logo and name. You can export to PDF or EPUB or both. I've done both. When you click on PDF, just look out over here. I'll show you. I'll click it now. And then you'll see it gives you a notification. We'll email you your PDF when it's ready. I, I got the PDF. I'll show it to you soon. When you click on EPUB, it goes to the Chrome extension download. So let's just click on uh, EPUB. Oop. Click on that. It downloads here. And then here you go. So you can see I've already tried it a few times. So there you go. This is what comes up. And you can just go through your... Uh, your manuscript as required. So I've tried it out two or three times now. <laughs> now here's the PDF so you, you can see what it looks like. Um, so this is basically reflective of the app over here. Um, so there's a title page, copyright table contents and so on. And I'll just pull up the PDF for you. So this is title page, copyright page over here, table of contents, and then it dives into the uh, the body of the manuscript. So, you know, so far it's been really good. I, I've enjoyed using it. Um, I'm still playing around the function, so it's not a, you know, it, it is a little glitchy at times, but like I say, I've emailed support a few times and they've always come back to me very, very quickly. Um, I'll include links in the description below. Um, feel free to go check Atticus out. Um, and like I said, I'm enjoying it so far. <laughs> um, I just wanted to share that in today's video. All right, so I'm going to leave it there. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a like. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And I shall see you in the next video. Have a great day, everyone.